new generation of super bods who love strong. Now, out of these 31 finalists, only two will emerge as the strongest of them all. Ladies and gentlemen, they fight for love. They win for love. And that's how super bods love strong. Get ready to witness the fiercest fight for this year's super bod.
original challenges and scores. From the presentations tonight, I will first announce the top eight females in no particular order. Judge for tonight is Mr. Mauro Lumba. Hello. Hi, Hello, Christelle. Mao. Hello. All right. So I have a question here. So, should government offices or private companies in the Philippines adopt a mandatory workout routine? Why or why not? Again, let me uh, say the question. Should government offices or private companies in the Philippines adopt a mandatory workout routine? Why or why not? <clears throat> Hello, everyone. Um, to be honest, I do believe that the government should prioritize other matters such as infrastructure and traffic. However, this doesn't necessarily mean that they still wouldn't implicate fitness and healthness to our mga kababayan. So therefore, I feel like if we prioritize on the right things such as infrastructure and traffic, we can also contribute to the well-being of our Filipinos and they could be able to, um, like for example, jog outside or practice health and fitness outside. Thank, Thank you. you so much, Christelle. Thank you, Judge Mauro. You may take your final walk. Born ready. Okay. For the people watching this competition who don't have any workout equipment in their home but want to stay fit and healthy for their loved ones, what would be your advice to them if they want to pursue a healthy lifestyle? That's actually very personal to me and I think a lot of people can relate because back in 2020, all the gyms were closed and suddenly no one could train in the gym, especially me who really enjoys going working out in the gym. I suddenly had to adjust working out at home and I think everybody has the ability to do the same as much as I can do and it doesn't need to be complicated. You only need your body weight and a will and a you know, happy mood. And for that, everybody can be fitness. Thank you. Thank you very much, Kirk. Looks like your judge is happy with that as well as the crowd. Here we go, ladies and gentlemen, the Super Buds 2022 female winner.
Country Tuna Superbot Love Strum 2022, of course. Thank you as well to these inspiring individuals who exemplify what a Superbot is strong for love and strong for life. It has been an immense pleasure hosting the finals night. Of course, I'm Mon Gutierrez. And we hope you guys would follow the journey of our newest Superbots as they continue to be strong for the ones they love. My name is Sam YG. Keep on posting your finals night experience using hashtag Century Tuna Superbots 2022 and hashtag Love Strong so we can always go back and relive this amazing experience. My name is Joey Victor. Again, thank you all for watching and remember, once, once a Superbots!